Make sure you check out our new sponsor, the Health Blaze. All the information is in the description. Use the promo code above. Good Fella One Boxing at 18% off of all their natural products from deodorant, pomade, toothpaste, and much, much more. And they have additional discounts on their website as well. That's the healthblaze.com. Start December 20th. That promo code is good for 18% off. We go. What's going on? We back. Good Fella Sports TV. We back in the building. Appreciate everybody checking in one time for the one time we grinding. Don't forget to check out our new uh a sponsor to help blaze the help blaze.com use promo code goodfellow one box and get 18 percent off on the top of additional discounts they're running over there on our on their all natural products from toothpaste foot soaks bath bombs and much much more go check out the help blaze.com all the information is in the description but we back and a lot of people not talking about that jamil charlo falls in line with the other stars of combat sports that fell victim to the mayweather curse ronda rosley fell victim to it I think people said Amir Khan fell victim to it, Manny Pacquiao, whoever, whoever's on that Mayweather curse list, um, add Jamil Charlo, on to that Jamil Charlo, um, earlier this year, not too long ago, called out Floyd Mayweather, you know, he was the only vocal boxer that called Mayweather out for making a punk move and fighting, uh, and trying to fight an MMA fighter attention, he said he need to fight somebody younger, and he had never fight somebody like the Charlo twins or like himself, Jamil Charlo. He said to TMZ, um, he called out Mayweather, and then, lo and behold, a few months later, he get his ass whooped by Detroit's own salute, 313 Detroit, y'all know what it is, man, the mitt, dirty glove, um, Tony Harrison, man, so I think a lot of people forgetting that uh, Jamil Charlo called out Mayweather, you had plenty of people before call out Mayweather, I think Amir Khan was calling out Mayweather, he got stopped um, several times, you had Ronda Rousey talk about Mayweather, he got stopped, you had Conor McGregor talk about Mayweather he got beat a couple times so that list just keep growing on and on and on a lot of dudes run their mouth about Mayweather and Mayweather ain't got to touch you for you to get touched if you catch the drift and um Tony Harrison held it down long legacy of great fighters from the murder mitt and um you know that's what Floyd from so you know that's what we do you know what I'm saying people ain't talking about how Jamel Charlo was out here calling Mayweather out and, and, and rightfully so man you know, Mayweather was out here, you know, basically exploiting the sport of boxing and going outside the network and fighting uh, vagabonds and fighting dudes from other sports that had no business in the ring with him. And, you know, most of these young guys, you know, if they want, if if Floyd, they think if Floyd wants to stick around, they should give him a shot. But Floyd is just going to make money moves, bro. Floyd going to get that, that, that low risk, high reward uh, type of fights with big money. And if people continue to keep funding Floyd Mayweather bum bashes, and keep funding him fight MMA fighters and kickboxers. Why not get the money while you uh willing and able? Why not go out here and get easy money? All these dudes will be willing to go get that same easy money. So you can't knock Floyd because he in the position that he worked to get in and laid the uh bricks and the foundation to get in, man. So, you know, you can never really hate on somebody that worked to get where they at and put the seniority in the years of hard work and he's financially, you know, and and actually creatively put himself in the position to get those type of fights. I mean, these dudes would be doing the same thing with those Floyd. They wouldn't be around here giving the real young killers um, or the real cat pillars an opportunity. But Jamil Charlo is another dude that fell victim to that. He went out here. He went out his scope of support. He called out Mayweather, even though Mayweather came and showed him love. It's basically like Mayweather, you know, came to the Charlo media workout before they card on Fox, touched him, and actually, you know, physically transferred and put the Mayweather curse on, on them. And, you know, they slipped and fell in showcase fights. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's just what happened, bro. That's what happened. You know, you go out here, you know, talk about Mayweather. It's like saying the candy man and saying candy man in the, in the mirror in the dark. You know what I'm saying? And they got, is you know, Jamil Charlo. Basically, uh, you know, he, he cursed his twin as well, too. His twin, in some people's opinion, lost, too. So, at the same time, bro, you know what I'm saying? That Mayweather curse is a real deal. Holyfield, man. So you got to watch out, man, what you say about Mayweather. You're going to fall victim to getting your ass whooped. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and that's, that's, what, that's what happened to Jamil, man. He almost passed the curse on to his brother. And that's why Mayweather showed up to that media workout in, in Houston, wherever they had it at. Mayweather went out there to put hands on him, man, to really put the blessing of the curse on them and say, okay, you want to keep calling me out? Let me come over here and, and personally bless y'all with this Mayweather curse. You know what I'm saying? And <laughs> that's the funny thing about it, man. But... Yeah, man, that's, it's funny, man, but it's good for the Sports TV. Don't forget, we on Facebook, Twitter. Um, also got a Facebook group. Also, reach them out to me in the email. 
you got a question, business inquiry, or sponsorship, or you can DM me on social media as well, man. Also, you want to make a donation to the channel, that link's there as well, too. Um, appreciate everybody for checking in one time for the one time. Happy holidays if you celebrate them. Um, don't forget the healthblazeman.com. All types of natural products, man, for good prices. I mean, like five, seven dollars on top of that. Get 18% off of my promo code, Goodfellow Unboxing. Go check out the Health Blaze, the healthblaze.com. All the information is in the description, man. I'm talking about real, real good natural products, man. You know, get natural, get right, and cut the chance, cut your risk of getting cancerous diseases that come with processed ingredients. Most people think of processed foods. You got to think of processed ingredients and in everyday products as well that's harmful to your system and body. So go over to the Health Blaze, the healthblaze.com. All the information is in the description, plus the promo code. Y'all know what the business is. One time for one time. Good fellow sports TV. We gone.